Hello again, Grade Tens. In this lesson, we will investigate one of the most important medical uses of sound. This procedure uses ultrasound, which is sound at a very high frequency. Ultrasound ranges from 20 kilohertz to 100 kilohertz in frequency. Once again, we'll join Nelly as she describes how ultrasound is used as a diagnostic tool in medicine. This is called ultrasound or the pulse echo technique. This is used to track the development of a fetus or to diagnose and position cancerous tumors in the body. The principle of it is similar to that which is used by bats in that a high frequency sound is sent out and a receiver interprets the echo that it receives. Because this is such important and frequently used technology, I think it would be interesting to look at it in more detail. The ultrasound machine consists of a number of parts. The transducer sends out and receives the sound waves. The sound is a high frequency pulse. The sound wave travels into the body and hits boundaries between tissues, for example the boundary between soft tissues like muscle and bone. Now, some of the sound waves are reflected back to the probe quickly, whilst others travel further before they are reflected. These reflected waves are picked up by the probe and are deciphered by a machine called a CPU or Central Processing Unit. The CPU calculates the distance from the probe to the tissue or organ using the speed of sound in tissue and the time of each echo's return. It then forms an image on a monitor. The CPU is also attached to transducer pulse controls that change the frequency, amplitude and duration of the sound waves and it is attached to a printer. In the past few years, ultrasound machines have been developed that can create three-dimensional images of organs or fetuses. The machine combines many two-dimensional images that are made from different sides to create one three-dimensional image. This technology has allowed for the early detection of tumors as well as any abnormal development of the fetus. Aren't the images incredible? You can see whether the fetus looks like its mother or its father even before it has been born. So, let's summarize what we have learned in this lesson. Ultrasound is an important diagnostic tool in medicine used to check for diseases, in treatment, and most importantly, in pregnancies. Ultrasound has very high frequencies that we cannot hear, between 20 and 100 kilohertz. The ultrasound is able to form images because at each boundary, say between muscle and bone, part of the wave is reflected and part is transmitted. The reflected rays are detected and used to construct an image of the object. The ability to see an image of the fetus allows us to check for abnormalities or illness and is therefore very useful. Grade 10s, you'll find more information about sound at www.mindset.co.za forward slash learn. Remember to try some of the questions in the task video too.